Hello parents, I'm Brad Duncan and I am the minister to students at First Baptist Church Chickasha. I wanted to take just a few moments to talk about a very important topic and that is rest. It's something that we don't do enough of but yet it's vitally important for our sanity. Trust me, sometimes we just need to get away. I was fortunate enough a few weeks ago to go on a retreat with some other youth ministers and it was great to be able to be alone and uh, be just me and God in the silence of the moment and I just want to encourage all of you to take moments just like that and you may be thinking how in the world could I go and take two days off and go by myself somewhere I have all kinds of responsibilities well it doesn't have to be like that here in uh, in Chickasha where I live there are uh, a lot of ways that uh, you can get away that don't require a long drive or a, uh, an overnight um, stay somewhere. Uh, from my house to the church is about 10 minutes. And what I can do, what I do sometimes is I'll turn my radio off. I will just sit in silence from my house to the church. And that allows me a chance to allow the noise in my mind, the things that are distracting me to become focus, uh, become the center focus and allow me to address each of those. If I have a bunch of noise or if I'm listening to a podcast or even music, I can't focus on the things that are on my mind. And there's a lot that we deal with as parents um, that can distract us from really, really important things. So I want to encourage you, if you have, have a chance, after you drop kids off or on your way to work, whatever, turn the radio off. Just kind of listen to silence for a little bit. If you have noise-canceling headphones or earbuds that have a noise-canceling feature, I encourage you to put those in sometime, set a timer, spend five to ten minutes just in total silence, not listening to anything, let, letting your mind adjust to just normal life. There's so many things that distract us and busyness has kind of become a badge of honor and I want to encourage you that if you are stressful and there are things that are stressful in your life that if you continue in those things then it will uh, it'll come out some other way. Uh, maybe it's an anger, maybe it's outburst of some some sort but whatever it is that you are dealing with, whatever it is that's stressful, I would encourage you to sit in silence. Uh, the Bible in Psalm 4610 says be still and know that I am God and I want to encourage you to be still and let God speak. Genesis 2-2 right at the beginning of the Bible it said when God was finished with his work he rested on the seventh day he rested. That's an encouragement that's a that's instruction for us spend some time even if it's a short amount of time spend some time in silence spend some time resting there are there are times during the day to do that don't neglect those Another thing is to find a way to read the, the Word of God every day. There are Bible apps, there are other versions, uh, other ways to read the Bible. Some of them can be read to you, some of them you can read yourself, Bible plans, but even if it's just a short scripture, spend time every day in, that, in the Word, listening to God, listening to Him speak to you because He speaks to you through His Word. And that's, that's what we have to do. We have to spend time in the Word. We have to spend time resting. We have to spend time however little we can find. And you'll find that God wants and enjoys that time with you as He, as he waits patiently for you to spend time with Him. If you have any questions, you can comment on this video. You can uh, call the church. You can call me or text me if you have my number. Email me as well. I look forward to hearing from you. And also, let me know how you find rest. What are ways that you can, that you find rest to help encourage other parents?